So, welcome to our van. I'm gonna give you a quick tour, show you why our vans are special. Um, first off, our bed. We have got a full-size bed with six foot three between the walls. Now it is adjustable in height, down from 18 inches all the way up to 48 inches. So whatever you need to throw underneath there, mountain bikes, anything really, you can make it work. Um, the other feature of our bed is that it can be set up as a couch or a bench facing either into the van or out the back for catching the sunset or lounging by the beach. So every Airy van starts with a steel subframe that we build into the van and that gives the shape to all of our wall panels. Behind that is thin slit insulation and we also do uh, kills mat on all of the panels in the van to keep road noise down and make it a lot quieter, more comfortable to drive. Then our wall panels go on and these are quarter inch Baltic birch plywood. So they're plenty strong enough. You can mount any of your accessories, hang things, whatever you want, pretty much anywhere on, on these walls and that's not gonna be a problem. So in our bed area, we have got shelves on both ends throw your clothes books whatever you need up there we've got an adjustable reading light this is all wired in there with um, usb outlet as well and there's also our max fan deluxe ventilation fan so this is a um, reversible fan so you can have cool air blowing out from outside in the summer or going up depending on uh, how you want to do it. Um, it's remote controlled, opening and closing all automatic, so really easy to use, do it from anywhere, um, doesn't take much power, and it's super quiet so you can leave it running all night, it's not a big deal. Moving on, we've got our galley cabinet here. We have a nice big deep stainless steel sink, stainless steel faucet, Electric water pump that is connected both here and to the outlet in the back. Underneath, we've got six gallons of fresh water and then our gray water tanks. These are easy to get, easy to replace. Plenty of room to store more of them if you're out for a longer trip. And on this side, we have got just a lot of storage area. This shelf is adjustable up and down. And we have five inch deep drawer. It's on ball bearing slides, soft close, everything there. So at the end of our galley cabinet, we have got our lagoon adjustable table. Um, it can come over here to function as a desk, eating table. It swings out to reach both chairs, both swivel chairs. And it is height adjustable and you can lock it into any position you want. It can also be dropped down to the level of the countertop to just basically function as an extension of that if you'd like as well. In order to bring the floor up to the same level as the front of the van. When you have the seats swiveled around, we add this cabinet here, which ends up housing all of our electronics. So our power inverter, fuse boxes, spare battery, they all go under here. And then you've got a little bit of uh, extra storage under here. And this is your power switch to disconnect all of the power to the back of the van. So for additional storage, we've got box here, steel box, mounts to the floor. It is reversible, so you can put the top on the bottom and it fits any of the um, portable cartridge toilets that are on the market today. We've got tie downs to strap it down there so it doesn't move while you're driving down the road. And that's it. So 
Underneath the bed, we've got our garage storage area. We've built in H-Track all the way around. Tons of options for mounting any accessories or tie downs, um, tying down bikes, motorcycle, whatever you want in there. These are bolted down through the frame of the vehicle, so plenty strong enough. Back here, we have got our water outlet. So this has a six foot hose with a nozzle for washing down snowboard, mountain bike, whatever equipment, or plugging into a shower unit. Uh, we also have 120 volt outlet, and this is our um, power switch to turn on the water pump for the faucet here. And then also have a light back here that turns on when you open the doors. So that concludes our van tour. You can check us out for more information on airyvans.com. We're also on YouTube, Instagram, and Facebook. Thanks.